Well, absolutely, it's a good thing. We should not be criminalizing a societal problem when we are trying to address the homeless population and the homeless issue here in Travis County. So absolutely, it's a good thing that we are reducing the number of tickets, but of course we do still see those folks in our court because public safety is at issue. So um, I believe it's much better on the front end for us to try to provide uh, some services to them that keeps them out of the criminal justice system. What about the sobriety center? I heard that that is helping as well with Austin police who are not taking somebody to a jail but taking them there mm -hmm. to the sobriety center? Absolutely. I see that while I'm providing more magistration services. Instead of uh, them being incarcerated, they go to the sobriety center to sleep it off. Mm -hmm. Judge, explain to me why it's better to have it that way than to have the homeless and then let them go down the road of being incarcerated because in the end that's expensive for taxpayers too. Absolutely. It's, it is estimated that booking fees alone run about $200 just for law enforcement to book someone in. Mm -hmm. That doesn't even account for the amount of monies to house and feed daily inmates in our Travis County system. Is there anything else that you think that we need to be doing better to go ahead and address this problem? Well, I, I think housing is the biggest okay. issue. If we can get folks in a stable residence, that goes a long way to addressing the homeless situation.